spirit, angels, and ancestors, I ask that you protect me and my viewers as I channel through these messages. I ask that you return anything that is not of you, anything dark that is not for the collective. Any spell work, please return it back to the sender, times 10. We ask that you protect us throughout this message. I thank you, I thank you, and I thank you. All right, we're going to get a singles message, guys. Let's pull some tarot first. This is for the singles. I've been getting requests, so let's, let's check out and see what the what, what spirit would like to say. What the, cards, what the cards would like you all to know. I'm just going to get an overall reading of the past, present, and future energy. I want you to think of three questions as I do so. Just think of three questions in order as I pull the cards. And I will give you an answer. I'm going to pull, like I said, three. Past, present, and future energy. I'm going to see who may be coming towards you as well. Be coming towards the singles. That sounds like coming towards the singles. This one. Leo. The answer is no. Scorpio. No again. energy you have the chariot coming in in reverse chariot speaks about movement so somebody is not moving in one second let me get this going high priestess came in pisces energy and the answer is yes this speaks about lack of direction when the when the um chariot card comes in reverse it's, it's no control you know no self-discipline or anything of that, that nature okay that's the overall energy the answer is yes, and it's a cancer. It deals with the moon. Okay. Now coming in your past energy in the upright position. You had the five of wands. And that deals with competition, like conflict, arguments, disputes, and things. All oh, that's in your past energy. I hope that's not in your current energy because that could be the reason why you're single. I hate to say it like that, but it is what it is. Okay. Coming in in your future energy, you got the tower. Mm. When the tower comes in the upright, it could it could talk about like sudden changes, catastrophe, um, things that deal with, you know, like sudden changes, upheaval, chaos. Also, can speak about revelations and having awakenings as well when it comes to the upright. Okay. The high priestess. In the upright speaks about your intuition, your sacred knowledge, divine feminine energy, and the subconscious mind. So that is your future energy coming in. So if you if you get the tower issues that's going on in the tower, you will have a high priestess moment. I can see that coming in your future. So that means that you, your person will be coming towards you either right before the holiday, either right before New Year's or right after New Year's is what I'm feeling. Okay. That's for a large portion of you, but for a select few of you, you're already with your person. You're just watching this for them. I feel the energy. Cross watchers, it's okay. We welcome y'all too. All right. Let's get some clarifiers. that for a large portion of you, you are 
are not really single. You're just here. Just checking out what's going on. But that's cool. We welcome you too. Five of Swords. Six of Pentacles. I'm going to pull two cards. Two alternative outcomes, okay? All of our energy is the lovers. You know what that's about? The lovers. Yes. The lover speaks about love, harmony, relationships, values, alignment, and choices in, in your relationship or in life or your self-harmony or disharmony when it's in reverse or imbalance or misalignment. Okay? So, before we pull that, let me clarify your past energy. It's going to be the two of wands. They talked about stalemate, like truces, having, you know, denial, blindness towards your person or anybody, open your heart up to love. I know everybody's been hurt before, and that's what I'm feeling with the collective. People are scared they're gonna get hurt again. You know, you, you, you will never know unless you take a chance. You gotta take a chance to take to see a change, okay? That, that's coming in. And that also speaks about avoidance, like avoiding dealing with what it is. If you have issues that you need to work on, please work on them. Self-improvement is, is so worth it, even if it's only for yourself, okay? All right, and also coming in, you have the Six of Pentacles, and that speaks about generosity, like support, help, you know, gratitude, and charity, okay? And you got the King of Swords coming in in your current energy. <clears throat> the answer is yes. It speaks about intelligence, structure, you know, Head over heart type of thing, like having morals, but also can speak about being detached. So if you're feeling detached or being detached, you can't find a mate being like that because nobody's going to understand your energy. Okay, so you got to open up your heart and lead with your heart. You don't lead with it on your sleeve, but don't make it ice cold either, you know. Like you got an ice box where your heart is supposed to be. You know, that's not cool. Okay. You have a six of cups as well in your current energy. And that speaks about being stuck in the past, like being bored, um, growing up, independence, and things like that. So that's what I'm feeling like you need to do. Please grow up and get out of that stalemate. Um, feeling detached and all that avoidance of change and all that good stuff. Good jazz. Well, this is where you're going to be with this nine of swords in your back in the bed. Sick. I don't know what to do with yourself. Heartache after heartache after heartache. It's called healing, baby. Get you some. All right. It works. I promise. Because you can have this. This queen of pentacles. And it starts somewhere. Because you got to nurture yourself. You got to comfort yourself. Sometimes you got to listen to your body. You got to do it. And if that's what you're doing, then just go ahead and continue. If you need to be alone right now because that's the best thing for you, then please, by all means, do so. Don't let nobody tell you what you need to be doing. If you feel that's what you're doing the right thing for yourself, then please stay single. Because it's enough hurt people out here. Because hurt people hurt people. So please heal. Get the guidance and the help or therapy you need. Guidance. And counseling and whatever you need and and just go that way but it's definitely worth it even if it's for yourself trust me i've done it several times and i'm right here preaching about it i'm a walking testament i will tell you that now i tell anybody that i believe in the power of therapy and counseling trust me We're going to get a future love uh, messages. I'm going to shuffle. Somebody is feeling unclear. Somebody has something to say. Okay. Alright, 
let's see what comes out. kids somebody wants to get you impregnated or you want to get impregnated by somebody whichever way it goes flip it switch the roles okay <clears throat> right away somebody wants you to pack a bag with them they want you they want to take you on a trip in one of my other readings check your other placements because um I just checked my page and checked the other readings because in one of them that I did yesterday, it was a Netflix and chill for the weekend. But somebody, whoever is Netflix and chilling this weekend, they are moving in together right before the new year or right around Christmas, one of the two. But it's kind of real soon. So when y'all sit down and talk about the leases that y'all have, well, the lease of each person, you guys are going to agree that it's best that you both work together and, and get it done. Because somebody is obsessed with one or, one or the other. Flip the switch the roles. Take what fits. Be the rest. Okay? Somebody feeling obsessed and another person feels lost without them. They want you back. They want you back bad. And the only thing you got to do is unblock them. Because that's there's, the only thing that's stopping their relationship. You got to unblock them. <clears throat> they miss you. I don't know if it's literally or energetically, but they miss you. And they want to talk to you. Okay? So let's get a few messages. What they would like to say. See? Told you. I am blocked. <laughs> oh. I was on the bottom of the deck. The passion is too much. Is that what you ran him away? This, who got this big D energy? I don't even want to know. Because as you can see, I'm, I'm not available. But somebody is. And somebody ran somebody off with it. Ooh. Okay, we'll keep moving. Keep moving. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody crying at night. They're thinking about you very hard. I mean, very seriously. They are seriously thinking about you. Got them crying. Oh, who that out there? I don't like people making people cry. Did they do something to you? What'd they do? Tell me in the comments. <laughs> I can't stop thinking about you. I was hurt by you. But I just know their emotions are very overwhelming. That's what I was feeling. <clears throat> that's what they were scared to tell you because that's what they was lying about. They ain't tell you that their emotions are very high for you. They really care about you. That's all it is. Flip the switch the rules, like I said, say what resonates and leave the rest. We're gonna get a few more love cards, a few more love messages, and then we're gonna Pull some messages from Spirit and close this message out, guys. It's a pleasure. Hit that like button. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe.
If anybody Netflix and the children this week can't leave it in the comments. I want to know. I'm nosy. Even if you're not Netflix and the chill, leave in the comments what you're doing. I'm going bowling. Um, probably to the movies. Now nah, I'm going bowling it out to eat. That's what I'm doing. Maybe a little Netflix and the chilling with my boot down. We shall see. If I'm not working. All right, guys. Again, just pulling. All of our energy. Can we just talk it over? Told you. 1616, as I said it. Synchronicities. I want more, but I am scared. That's what they was wasn't honest about. Told you. They want it. They want it, but they scared. They scared. Stop being scared. We grown out here. Do you still think about me? Of course they do. That's what I was feeling. That's what made me do this reading. Is there a second chance? Absolutely. You better know it. I want to make it up to you, but then do it, Sway. How about it? Make it make sense. Just do it. Like Nike, just do it. All right, <laughs> you don't get some messages from Spirit, intimacy. Y'all got off the chains, sex. That thing is off the bomb. But somebody didn't keep gambling with this relationship. I don't know who it is or why you're doing it, but please stop. If you want this person, if you want your person, stop gambling with a relationship. Stop blocking. Unblock that person. Unblock each other. When y'all gonna be together, that all that blocking and unblocking, that's unhealthy. It's toxic. It's very toxic. If you're gonna block, keep it blocked and keep it moving. Move around. Move accordingly. If not, then don't keep blocking and unblocking. Just tell the person you don't want to talk to them. When you get to them, You'll get to them so that you don't become no daggone narcissist. Or they don't, because they might be. And then this. So, hey. <laughs> Y'all better get with the program. All that block or no block. Swipe or no swipe. Shit. Block or no block. Leaving people on red. Come on, y'all. Not even calling for it now. These days. All right. Like I said, we're going to get some messages from the universe. Distance. Right now, you and your person are at a distance. Because this is a singles reading. Yes, you are. Okay. 19 minutes exactly as I said it. I'm gonna get some messages from Spirit. Let's see what I got to say to you all. Give it time. Sexuality, someone is still figuring themselves out. Is that what caused the breakup? Somebody don't know about their sexuality? I feel somebody out there is very bi-curious. And I do know it ain't me. So what came out is give it time. The Spirit wants you to give it time. Everything in divine timing, okay? Let things just flow. Don't try to force anything. What fits, fits. If it don't, it don't. Just like this reading. If it's for you, it's for you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Communicate. You know, compromise. Work with each other. Or else just let it go. 
one of the two. Just let it go. New beginnings. One or the other. It was 2020 when I said it. Let's get some numbers and close this video now, guys. So I got nine. Three, three, thirteen, two, five, and sixty. So I got sixty, five, two, thirteen, three, two, and nine. Like, share, and subscribe, guys. Thank you, singles.